G'day guys, today we are going to be changing our bottom board on this new hive that we caught, a swarm, uh, a couple of weeks ago. And we only had a um, entrance that was really big on one of our boxes and now we're going to swap it with this one here. You can see the entrance is really small because they're such a small hive and they're only just sort of building up. Um, it gives them less space to guard. So we could be promoting robbing bees um, because they've got such a wide entrance at the front of that box. Um, at least this would be easier for them to guard until they build up in numbers. So what we're going to do, I reckon I'm just going to lift off the whole hive to start with. Sit the new bottom board there and then take the top of this box off and sit it back on top. Now I'm not sure how this is all going to go, but we're going to find out very soon enough. Okay, get over there, get our new bottom board here, ready to go. Be happy with that. Position. Okay, now we're going to take this actual hive off the bottom board. Up in there, minimal damage to bees. I think that should be okay. There you go. Oh, good boy, girl, I should say. Okay, make sure the queen's not on here. There's only a handful of bees here, that's fine. We'll just leave that there now. I'm going to just have a look inside here and just see what the progress is like on this hive. Last we checked they were drawing out comb. Pretty good. I was curious to see what's going on. It's been pretty cool lately so I'm not expecting a hell of a lot of action. Okay. So... Yeah, it looks like they're drawing out a fair bit. We did give them a full frame of honey, which is this last one. I'm really curious to see how their stores are going and whether they need any more. Um, I just don't want them to run out of food at such an early stage. There's a really lot of bees on here. But this was a full frame of pretty much capped honey when we put it in here. So, I just want to have a look, it's alright, I've got it. I just want to see how it's looking. Oop. Okay, I can still see a fair bit of capped honey on this. Yeah. So I'm not going to take it all the way out, I don't want to disturb them too much. So, they have eaten a bit of it. Like I said, I was just worried about robbing bees. I'm just gonna gently that's right, I'm just gonna gently take this out. I don't want to disturb them too much. Okay, so they've still got a fair bit of cat honey on that. There's not a lot of weight on here. So They're definitely into it. And they are eating it, so that's good. That's why we put it in there. Um, so I'm gonna crack this a little bit. Yeah, it's still honey there. I wish I could eat that. Okay, so I'm just gonna gently put this back. Try not to disturb too many. Okay, everybody, look out, go on in. Very calm bees, beautiful bees. And put that in there like that. Haven't squashed anything yet, which is awesome. That's cool. Okay. So now we can get the lid back on. I'm not gonna disturb them too much. These are very young, they haven't done too much. They've drawn a bit of comb out. We did put some um, 
brood comb from the original swarm that we found um, and that's still in there so I think they're happy enough but now they've got a smaller entrance I don't need to guard as much so we'll get that back on there we'll strap that up soon enough just keep them happy now what we also want to do is have a quick look in this one um, this one's been firing for a long time um, we thought we were going to actually do a bit of a honey harvest on this <coughs> but um, ended up we caught another swarm and we took some of the um, honey out to feed this new hive so this one I've got a ideal depth box super on the top here um, that was just more for giving them a bit of room because they were drawing out all the other full depth box we've got a queen excluder in between the first and second box second box is all honey um, and that's pretty much all drawn out not all fully capped but so we're leaving it we know they've got enough stores for winter I'm not overly fussed about harvesting honey at this stage we just want them to get through the winter with the stores that they have so okay let's see how we go here not much action at all in this top box nothing nishta so all into the second box it's getting cold now so they're not coming up too high for a bit of um, coolness so no, they're all good but nothing getting drawn on this box here. I might even have to take that off if we start getting into some cooler weather if winter sets in a bit earlier than what we think. But I think we've got a bit of hot weather coming up this week or warmer weather. Um, so we're going to leave that on for now and see how they go. But looks pretty good to me. I'm pretty happy with that. So anyway, um, that's just a basic bee inspection. Beehive inspection, changing the entrance. Um, they've just got a smaller area to guard, as we explained, um, just so they don't get any robbing bees. You can see the difference here if you look at the entrance of this one. That's fine for a, uh, you know, a big colony. Probably like that one there might need this coming into spring, but uh, at this stage of the game, they will be fine for winter. Uh, thanks for watching and um, if you haven't already subscribe and share some comments if you've got any tips feel free to add anything thank you see ya